Hey guys, today we're continuing from previous episodes where we learned the mix between Krav Maga to other martial arts and we actually started to talk about defending strike and take him down. Now today we'll be continuing and learning how to take him down all the way, neutralize him and to put him in a position that I can hold him this way for as much as I want till the cops are coming, till other people are safe, right? Depends, of course, what is my purpose. First, we'll do it we'll, uh, quick, and then we'll break it down. Come down, I feel okay. it's too dangerous. Boom, boom, boom! There you go. Now, look to what kind of situation I brought him. I put leverage on one of his hands with one leg, but now it's with my left leg. And the other leg is putting pressure I'm sure he's not really comfortable <laughs> <laughs> sure he putting pressure with my knee, my shin, and I'm leaning, really putting my whole weight on it while making sure those legs are tight. Now from here, of course, that I could strike or I could choose to uh, just take the other hand. Now from here, he, he can't really resist. Boom, take the other hand. Now, for security purposes, put handcuffs your cup, your security guard. First thing, strike, strike. Or if it's a choke, reacting against the choke, releasing the choke, boom, but strike. Make sure to distract him, to make sure he, he, he cannot really resist to the hole that I'm planning. Now I'm holding, I can hit another kick. Oh, now from here, what I did is leaning a little forward, putting pressure, forcing with a little bit with my thumbs, both of my thumbs, boom, and pulling with the other hands towards me. What happens is this, Opa. right? Putting those, this pressure with the thumbs. Now from here, I twist my body, I take my left leg, and I create a big circle while I'm rotating over my body, and look what happens. Opa. Always pulling, don't let him take you down. That means you're controlling his hands close to your central body. When he's here, all you gotta do, step forward, right? With this hand, and this little push. Look what happened to him. Now from here, I am turning. I have to do it real quick. Look what I do. Bend his elbow, putting myself on my left knee, leverage down, and now putting the real pressure on his back, on the back of his neck. Oh my pressure, I can strike, I can tell him, give me the other hand, give me the other hand. Now I'm in the real control, and I can hold him for almost as much as I want. Excellent. That's, as we said, step number one. Step number two will be what? Forcing his hand down, pushing from the thumbs, leaning forward a little bit. That means I'm not just pushing from the thumbs. The thumbs doesn't have that much yeah. power, but the oh, body weight, while pushing from the bone here, no, oh, that yeah. has much more strength. Strike, boom, strike, yeah, make sure he's in the right state, you're taking, there you go, now you took him, nice job. Now, you step over him with your left, well, look what I do with my right. Okay. Kind of a motion with the inner part of my knee. Okay. That's great, yeah. excellent. Now, you're still forcing on his wrist, the leverage is always there, yes. right? So he couldn't really turn back. Now from here, you have to be real quick, but we'll break it down. What you do is you leave the right hand, you bend while, while putting your left knee not on him, okay. on the ground, just uh, on here. The ground. Oh, there you go. Now his elbow, you're locking his elbow with your leg, putting pressure towards his head, excellent. While the other leg, putting pressure on his back of his neck. Now you can actually leave those hands. All right, if the hold is strong enough, you're really putting the pressure. Now you can strike him, of course. You can ask for the other hand. Give me your hand. There you go. So, just to conclude what we had today, as we continued from last episode, when we what we talked about that we, we mixed Jiu Jitsu, Aikido and Krav Maga after 
the Krav Maga defense. Boom, boom, right? Defending with reactions. Or if it's a choke, defending with a Krav Maga choke. Boom, boom, boom. And then I can continue, mix other martial arts, right? Here we talked about putting him all the way to the ground. Boom, and controlling, neutralizing him. Boom, taking the other hand. And now you're in real control. You can leave him here. Federica, nice job. Thank you. Thank you again.